So yeah, can you continue on? My kids are getting lots of Richard Scary books. But I can't your kids are because they love Richard Scary. And Richard Scary has a lot of different animals in it. Dogs, cats, pigs, birds. I also have 12 easy read stories. There there you have it. My 8 year olds going to love it. And my 7 year old has it. And I want my 8 year old to have it. So there's that. Um, along with all that, we have more books. The 10 Little Ladybugs, which I'm not sure if this if you consider this insects or animals. I guess they're insects, and they love ladybugs. My 8-year-old does. She loves uh, the, the the 10 little or 5 little stuff. So I picked her up the 10 little ladybugs book, and she's obsessed with ladybugs. So that's why I picked her up that book. Along with that, we have the Spiders book by Esborn. She wanted a Spiders book, and I picked up this one because I know that she loves it, and she loves spiders. Excuse me. Along with that, I know that my eight-year-old's gonna love animals, and she loves the 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 Disney uh, animal stuff. So I picked her up the the wild animal, different di just book, and it has her animals in it that I know that she's going to adore so much. Along with that, this isn't this isn't an animal one, but it's Amelia Bedelia. My eight-year-old loves Amelia Bedelia. Bedelia, so there's that for her. Along with that, we have these these brand new books for both my younger kids to share. Easter Story. Haunted House, Lift the Flop, which both my kids love, love, lift, love, live the, love, uh, love, lip, lift the flap, and Ghost Walk. Along with that, my 18 year old is going to be getting these books because she's really obsessed with um, these little books. She loves the all, all of her books, and she also loves um, elephants and animal books, just like my, my 8 year old. So, so she has that. Along with this book, which looks really cool. I'm not sure what it's about, but it looks really cool. So my 18-year-old is going to be getting that book as well. To go along with that, my 8-year-old is going to, my 18-year-old is going to be getting this Weasels book. It looks really cool, and Weasels are really cool. Um, And just loves weasels. So I wanted to get this book for my eight year old. Not sure what type of animal it is, but yeah. Along with that, we have Five Silly Monkeys. She wanted a Five Silly Monkeys book. So I got her the Five Silly Monkeys, and she loves the the heads of the monkeys and also of the of ladybugs. Like I said before, she loves. Loves Five Little Monkeys or loves monkeys in general, so that's why I picked that up for her. Along with that, I had to, I just had to, like, can't deny it, but I just had to, right? Pick her up my eight year old, these other animal books that she's obsessed with animals, like are this biscuit book. It's gonna be my first easy for sharing and urgent readers. And then I also picked her up the Arthur's Camp Out, which is a chapter book, which she's obsessed with chapter books. And it looks like it's pretty easy read for her. And to go along with that, this is a level two, so it's the I can read books, uh, one, one to third grade. And then to go along with all that, I also thought the chicken and mittens would be cool because it has a chicken and pigs in it, and she loves animals. So there's that. Ma, yes, can you come uh turn um the windows on? Huh? Can, can you come turn the windows on? Come turn the windows on. You mean open the window shade? That way it's not so dark in here. It looks so gloomy. Gotta open them every day. Oh, well. Great as well. I, I think you guys are gonna run to Lowe's later and get some lamp shades. That's okay with you. Wait, once you get back? Yeah. Can you get back? Yeah. I'm fine. I mean, he was like down here, Mama. Uh -huh. Look, r right here on my lap. He just turned over. I mean, flipping, biting. I'm like, huh, stop. And he just like kept, ro kept going just around me. Like, 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 for, like, before Gray left, yeah? Oh. This is wild. But we love him. Um, along with that, we just have this Rumpelstiltskin, which we are addicted to. And my eight year old wanted a Rumpelstiltskin book. She loves books. She loves. Like this, and she wanted a petite book like this uh, for only a dollar at Walmart. 
Um, and the illustrations and stuff are really good too. And the pictures are glossy. This is one that she was missing is the Ripple Stole Skin. And I think I also got her the, or, or, or I am getting her the Sleeping Beauty or a different princess one. To go along with that, the Kanga, Kanga and Bibi Roo come to the forest, which is another little animal one. She loves Winnie the Pooh. And all these animals. She loves all these animals. Uh, so I thought that, that book would be perfect for her. And it's a pretty easy read. I don't expect her to be super easy to read that. But it's pretty easy to read. Because she's really actually able to read stuff like that. Plus, The Missing Kitten. I thought that she would love this book. It She really is into the Pet Rescue Adventures books. And she has some already. This has The Missing Kitten, The, the Abandoned Kitten, and The Unwanted Kitten. And it's a pretty good book. It does have some pictures in it. And... It's a pretty nice read for her. It is pretty. It, it is a good, good chubby book. So I decided to pick that one up for her. Along with that, we have the fancy Bear books that my eight-year-old is going to be ge getting. Bedtime Battle, Missing Honey, Trouble with Pets, Green Eye Monster, The Nutcracker, and also Hospital Friends. So that those books would, would be really cool um to go along with all that we also have these books this is for my eight my eight-year-old boy the truth mercy real book and franklin's blanket he has some franklin books already and he really wanted that franklin book so decided to get him that franklin book next stop we have these books down here Make sure I do up here. Um, I do. Uh, I'll do right here. Okay. Get ready, cause we have a lot of Curious George books. My kids are obsessed with Curious George, so you guys will see see a lot of that. Um, Curious George book, Tadpole Trouble. Like I said, eight year olds obsessed with animals, along with my eighteen year old. So this is just so this is a Tadpole Trouble book. When you open it up, um. Just tells you the life of a, a, a butterfly, so that is really cool, and, the, and you can do a couple activities. That, that, that is for my um, for my eight year old because she says with, with with animals, a good one for Halloween, but it's gonna be prob probably for my um eight year old is the goes to a costume par party. Uh, again, the reason I love Curious George books is because they're animal related and or Curious George and Curious George is a monkey for my eight year old, so that's why it fits hit her spot perfectly. Caution Party, a lift a flat book, Max and Ruby, my eight year old, again, loves Max and Ruby, loves the Nick Jr. show, and loves to lip the flaps. So when I saw this, I had to get it for her. She's obsessed with lift the flaps, and I just thought, hey, why not? And it goes along with Halloween, so we can read this during Halloween um, time for my eight year old. So that's again for my eight year old. Another one is Merry Christmas, again for my eight year old, because it's Christmas themed. So we can read it with, with Christmas time. Lovely. And I love Christmas stuff. And it's really cool. I can't wait for my 8-year-old to have this book. My 8-year-old's going to be getting these books right here. Um, I think my 8-year-old is. Yeah, my 8-year-old. Um, should I give this to my 8-year-old? 8-year-old. They really, She's so obsessed with these. With the girls' book. How to be the best. Everything. And the girls' book to Glamour. A guide to being a god, a god, I don't know. So, pick these up because um, why not? And they look really cool. And because my eight, my eight year old loves to do like crafts and activities when her friends come over. So I picked up these for her um, to have on hand. Along with that, along with that, Mark George, Kier George goes to an ice cream shop, which to be quite honest. We love ice cream and I think my eight-year-old would actually love this book so there's that takes a job I think my eight-year-old would again well love, love the book to be quite honest my seven-year-old is kind of with your George but isn't that much that obsessed of how my eight my my, my, my eight-year-old is so my seven-year-old isn't gonna be getting any Kier George books but my eight-year-old is going to because yeah uh, again we have the Kier George takes a PlayStation which I think goes this a PlayStation, which I know he's going to love. Well, she's going to love again because he's because she's really into 
Here's George. Like I said, what well, happens to your food? I think my my eight year old would adore this book. Uh, it's just really nice, and it just like goes through, like the whole thing about it. You can lift this up. Just talks about the whole thing, which I know that he's that she's going to love. And my eight year old, my seven year old already already has a book like this, and I want my eight year old to have one. So I picked up this right here. For for her, the mermaid dives in, which Doc McStuffins is my kid, my my eight year old's favorite. Plus, she loves the animals, the stuffed animals that are in here, and she watches the show all the time, um, too. And she loves Doc McStuffins as a doctor, and it's just like a very nice show that she loves to watch and loves mermaids. So, perfect fit for her. Along with that, she loves animals, so she also loves Olivia. So I picked up the Olivia Pizza mural for her. It's a board book, yes, but she loves Olivia. She loves to paint, and she's a, again artsy, just like her 18-year-old sister is. And it's very nice, and she just loves books like this. So I thought that she would really like this book. And she already has the other ones on the back, so I wanted to pick her up that book for her. Plus, it's pigs, so there's that. Her three more books, again, the Bansy Bears B book, which she loves anything. Um... And also, what's what's really cool is that's again animal related. Um, the reason I love here's Bear's Bear books because they're animal related, which my kids love, um, and they're just really cool. I love these things. So this one is going to be for my eight year old girl. This one is again, excuse me, going to be for my eight year old girl. She is really obsessed, and this one is too. So they are the thinking and the what books. They're very nice books, and the reason I like these for my 8-year-old is because my 18-year-old used to have these, and they get her thinking, and what I mean by thinking is she loves these books. They are really nice for her, so she's like, what are the part of my brain? And and, and then they can, like, like learn, like, something, like, scientific or knowledge about it, like, when can I remember something to, so, so, something but most other, but, but, why can I remember something but not others? Like, this is, like... This is so cool. I love these type of books. And I used to actually read these when I, when I was little. And my 18-year-old loves these too. So, so this is the thinking one. So it's like, so it's kind of like you're thinking. Like you're like, you're like kind of like, hmm, like you're wondering. So it's kind of like a wondering. And then this one is what. So it's like what, like for example, like what makes puddles disappear? So it's kind of like a, like a what you're asking question. So like what causes earthquakes? What are freckles? And then they can like learn stuff about them that's why i like these books so much they're very nice and my 18 year old used to have these too so we have the when well the what and the thinking which she's also going to be getting some more um too my eight year old so i got her some of these because she already has some already but i want to get her some more earth and beyond which i know my eight year old is going to love she's obsessed with anything science and history and planets and i thought that this book would be perfect especially because it has a dog on the front but she loves planets so when I'm ready to get her that. Curious George Snowy Day, which I think she's going to really enjoy. Uh, she loves again Curious George and, the, and snow. This is perfect for Christmas. And there's also an activity of Make Your Own Snowflake, which she's going to love. Um, so, that's for her. Hmm. Uh, Biscuit Meets a Class Pet, which again, you guys know, is for my eight year old. It's bunnies. Cat. Yeah. Bunnies and dogs, amazing. Idea for sharing with urgent readers. And again, this is for her. But there's that. Uh, she's also my my eight year old girl is, is obsessed with these little petite tiny books. So I picked her up from the Little Golden Book Collection, Disney Tangled. Loves Tangled. And she has some of these, some of these little small petite books of Disney uh, princesses already. So I picked her up this one. And it looks super cool. She loves the Disney princess books. And she loves these small petite ones. They're perfect for her, ba her, for her pack, backpack. And it also has stickers, which, I, which she put on this page. Which I don't know what she put on the page. But she loves... Little petite books like this, and this, and she won the tangled one, so I picked up the tangled one, tangled one for her collection. Along with that, my my first counting book, 
She already knows about counting, but she loves cats and dogs and everything like that. And this one just has it in there. So this one, each number is a different animal. So for example, dog is one. Woolly lambs are two. Horses are three. It's just like each page is a different animal. And it's just a really nice book for her to learn about animals and everything like that. So again, that's for her. The, the doctor is in Bo Bo Guppies for $3.77. Which she's going to love. She loves bubble guppies. And I thought that she would lo love this book. And it's from Walmart. And I know that she's going to love this. She um, she already has some of the other books on the back. So she already has the Dora the Explorer and this little puppy one. Uh, she, and she already has this uh, Doc Mc this this uh, bubble guppies one. Her eight-year-old brother, oh, seven-year-old brother has this, the Scruffy, the Tugboat. Boat, and my eight-year-old has the Spongebob one. Seven-year-old has this book. Eight year old has this one, and my eight year old has this elephant one too. So I wanted to pick her up another bubble guppy book because she loves the bubble guppies and she watches them on, on the TV all the time. Cute George takes a trip again, which is amazing, and she loves Cute George and airplanes and all that fun stuff. And I thought that I thought she would like this. Let's see, on the go. So this is just like a little uh, powdered, like powered truck thing, and this maze that she can do, which she did, and uh, just like a little fun thing. So she loves planes. It's just amazing. So I picked her up for this little travel one because she loves loves airplanes. We actually went on an airplane once and she loved it. And I'll be right back, guys, because I have to go to the bathroom. So I'll be right back. BRB. 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 Be right back. BRB. Be right back. Oh, dang it. BRB, guys.
I'm back, guys. Hi. So we have the Anointed Meat Cure George, which is always a classic. Um, we are really into the Cure George books, but I think my seven year old will actually enjoy this one more just because my eight year old already knows, like, knows who Cure George is and doesn't really need the simple explanation like my seven year old might. So. And it has little images too, nice cool pictures. So, I've, so this one's gonna be for my seven year old boy. Um, even though I didn't say that any character books would mainly be for him, this one is because my eight year old mainly mainly knows who Kier George is. Uh, Kier George's Dream, which my eight year old's gonna love. These are hardcover books, and some of these other ones are bigger, like this one. While some of them, on the other hand, are. Like, for example, big. Uh, Cure George Dream, which is just a hardcover and very nice book. Has tiny words in it, but still it's a very nice book. So we have the dream for her, for my eight-year-old. Cure George, uh, George and the Hot Air Balloon. And Cure George Feeds the Animals, which you guys are probably wondering. I think I know how, they, how this is going to be for my eight-year-old. Yep, you're right. Animals. She loves animals, and for example, they go to the they go to a zoo, and can you guess? This is seals. They love. She loves animals. Like I said, so this one has tons of different animals, like crocodiles, just different animals. So that's why that that's why that sounds for And then another one by the I almost said the Golden Girls. Clearly, <laughs> is the Prince and the Frog. She loves these these Disney um, stories by um, from uh, the Golden Books, and she wanted the Princess and the Frog one, and this is one that she was missing, and it's more of a bigger one, and she really is going to enjoy this one. She loves Princess and the Frog, so I had to, I had to, I had to, I had to, I had to. So this is what it looks like. And because it also has her pet as a frog, so did you guys guess it's kind of, it's a kind of an, an animal kind of I don't know. Um, also, I'm telling you guys, there's tons of books here. Uh, the monster at the end of this book, which my eight year old has, so this one's for my uh, this one's for my eight year no for my yeah my eight year old. This is my actually my yeah no actually my my seven year old my seven year old has this no my eight year old has this my seven year old does not so that's for him he loves Sesame Street and Grover that's his that's his, that's one of his favorite um characters is Grover uh Biscuit goes to school it's the ideal for sharing with urgent readers my first and this is the Biscuit goes to school of course it's dog it has a dog which is the main purpose for why I got this book for her. It's dogs. And she loves biscuit books, so there's that. She's also obsessed with Sophia the Enchanted Sci uh, Science Fair, and this has over 60 stickers in it. And she already used some of the stickers already. She likes to put stickers on pages, like here's an example. But she loves Sophia the First books, and I thought, why not? And it's really nice for her, and she just loves Sophia the First. So, remember, I saw this, I had to because she loves the show on Disney Junior. Um, so I picked this one up for her because she loves Sophia the first and anything science to do with science. Along, along for my 18, my eight year old, can you guys guess? You heard right. You heard right. You heard right. A bugs book. She's obsessed with bugs. So it only was fair to get her a bugs book. Like, yeah, a bugs book. Bugs. Like I said, loves animals, loves insects, had to. Cure George and the Firefighters. This one is cure this one is like the whole like meeting Curious George type of book. It's like the old book. So this one I will give to my eight year old because I think she she like this one. Because my seven year old is gonna be getting this one, which is more of a, like a petite one. 
and smaller and not the full book. This one's really cool because it like goes to like the whole story and the whole premise and this one has very like old style pictures and good words and stuff like that. So it's a more of a bigger book for her. So 